Now to the federal civil rights investigation and to the death of a 29 year old man days after traffic stop by Memphis police landed him in the hospital in critical condition. Steve Osinsami joins us with the latest. Good morning, Steve. Good morning to you, Michael. The family of Tyree Nichols wants answers and they want the video of what happened to their son released to the public. Now the Civil Rights Division of the U.S. Department of Justice has launched an investigation into this incident. Memphis police confirmed that this young man died after a traffic stop on January 7th. They say that they had what they call a confrontation with the young man. Then they say he ran away and that there was another confrontation with police when they detained him. They say it was after this when he complained that he was having trouble breathing. The family is sharing this photo, asking what in the world could have happened, what type of confrontation over a traffic stop could have led to these kind of injuries. They say he was barely recognizable. His family says his heart stopped and his kidneys failed. Memphis police say they'll share their police video of what happened after their internal investigation is completed. The officers who were involved have been placed on administrative police. Administrative leave. Police say that they are working with federal investigators and they say they plan to meet with the family's attorney in the coming days. George. Okay, Steve, thanks. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.